Now, dear learners, this is all about the unit one nature of formal logic. Now, I think uh, you have understood. And the all about the main summary of this uh, unit that is nature of formal logic are in a very nutshell uh, that is the term logic is derived from the Greek word logos which means thought or reasoning thus logic is a study of reasoning and Aristotelian logic is a formal logic formal logic is concerned exclusively with the principles of deductive reasoning and it is concerned with the forms rather than with the content of propositions. Deductive logic is formal logic as opposed to inductive logic which is non-formal logic or material logic. Logicians are primarily concerned with the correctness or incorrectness of arguments. The distinction between correct and incorrect argument is the central problem with which logic deals. Aristotelian study of syllogism focused on arguments containing propositions of a special kind called categorical propositions. Categorical propositions consist of subject, predicate and the copula. Modern logic or symbolic logic is a formal logic or symbolic logic is a developed form of Aristotelian logic. The difference between symbolic logic and Aristotelian logic is not a difference of kind but a difference of degree. Dear learners, in propositional calculus, the letters of the alphabets like the small letters P, Q, R, S, T and so on stand for propositions and these letters are used in propositional calculus are known as propositional variables because they can stand indifferently for any proposition. Thus, in symbolic logic, compound propositions are symbolized by means of variables and constants. Now, dear learners, you know that the symbolic form P dot Q, P val Q, P implies Q, or negation P, etc., are called truth functions because the truth or falsity of these functions depend on the truth and falsity of the constituent variables like P and Q. Symbolic logic as formal logic is concerned with the validity or invalidity of different argument forms rather than with the validity or invalidity of particular individual arguments. Formal logic is not concerned with the empirical truth or falsity of propositions. It is concerned with formal truth and formal validity. So, dear learners, these are all the very basic points of the unit one nature of formal logic. Now, dear learners, to know the units, to understand the unit in a very uh, comprehensive manner, you have to study some books. That books are for you. You can write down the names of the books. Then you can take Sham Kishore Singh's book, that is Modern Logic, that is Volume 1, and you can take Arving M. Copy, that is Symbolic Logic, 5th edition. And you can take also one book, that is Krishna Jain, 
the book's name is a textbook of logic and also you can take another book very important book that is Irving M Kopi Cohen and Carl Cohen and Priyodor Sini Jetli and Monica Prabhakar's book that is introduction to logic dear learners i think you have understood the unit and you go through the unit and you study all the books which i have referred to you thank you